Nostalgia. Remember the old stuff? Old stuff like me? When it was better? Or different? Or. Well, just watch the episode and find out what it means to you. Ten years. Yeah. Oh my god. I was just earlier. I was just telling my fucking dumb bitch of a wife. I was telling her about all the fucking good times we used to have. Oh man, fuck us. We had some great times back in the day. Those were the uh, fucking good old days. Let me uh, tell you. Remember when we had? I had you over for seventh grade for my birthday. And we had all the guys over, yeah. and you we ate it's, all the hot readies, and you took a big shit in my <laughs> toilet, and my, you clogged it all up. My I, dad was mad. At you. I love those hot and readies, but man, he was mad. That he was, was very pissed. embarrassing. Yeah, <laughs> man. Well, oh, those were the oh, days man. of... Remember the time I had that Halo 2 party? We also had all those hot red <laughs> yes! and you guys came over. And then I took a big dump in your I, own house! <laughs> I plugged up my own toilet! It was <laughs> so stinky! <laughs> I remember Jeff went home. Yeah, it, smelled, it smelled so much like poop. He's like, I gotta get out of here. It smells like poop. Oh my god, that's the kind of stuff I'm telling you about, man. I miss it. You still, uh, you still doing those big dumps? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. The doctor said I shouldn't do those anymore. You're gonna listen to a doctor, dude? Come on, you're you're the Jesse the Bomber, the Bomber Jacket. You gotta take those big dumps. That's why we like to have you on. I, lo I like dropping those bombs, but you know the doctor says I sh I trust the science. You know, so the doctor says he's, he told me that if I keep doing it, I might never stop. Like if you keep shitting, you might never stop. Yeah, I, I didn't really know what he meant, but I didn't press for details because, you know, he's the doctor. I'm not a doctor, so. So you just, you don't take big shits anymore, or you don't. I don't, I don't shit. I, I barf everything up now. Yeah. Well, I mean, the good news, well, hey, I'm thinking I'm going to turn in. I'm a, my, uh, my oh, dogs yeah. are barking. I yeah, gotta, it's getting pretty uh, late. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, and, I mean, it was great catching up. I oh, think, yeah. uh, we, I mean, heck, we should do it again sometime. Yeah, yeah. Um, Hopefully, it doesn't take ten years this time. Yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah. Wait a minute. He left me home alone. He left me home alone. <laughs>
Your subject is nostalgia, and I was thinking of all the things that helped me think back to remembering good times. Like this picture, I've got my sister and a best friend that have both passed away since then, but that brings back good memories. Is that nostalgia to me? That is. I meet every month with my high school graduate friends, but there's about a dozen of us that still meet, but we keep track of who's died. If you see obituaries, you're putting in there, you know. And, and of course, when I go on trips with friends, I always make notes of what's happening, and because you forget all that stuff. These, you did. These are all done by Corey. Well, some are funerals, some are just old time movies, way back, way back when I was in my 20s, so you know how far back those go. I'm not real good about it anymore, but I always you know, diary or journal, whatever you want to call it. I like to look back, and your mom reads them. <laughs> she, she's the only one so far that's ever gotten interested, but she'll go back and read them. This is back when my cat the party store down, this, down the road here. That's two of his customers, and I wish I knew who they were. I could give them a picture. Do you want me to show you something? Yeah. Is that to follow? <laughs> Write to me a lot. I kind of have saved that this is all my cousin's letters I'm giving to her. <laughs> They're like a journal for her. When they read what they wrote years ago, it's kind of like keeping a diary. I don't want to lose, you know, memories of my mom, dad, or sister, or brother. So you have things and you look at them and see a picture of them when they were young and healthy. You remember that that was good. Nostalgia kind of, I'm, I'm a sucker for that. <laughs> Pictures help, and the movies help a lot. But I don't have a DVD player that's working. I have to get one so I can watch those again. A lot of stuff you guys are gonna have to take care of when I'm gone. <laughs>
Hey, Big Bird. Hi. Oh, hi, Grover. Oh, did I startle you? Oh, just a little bit. I was just sitting here lost in thought. What you thinking about? Mm, I was just thinking about how when I was a little baby chick, it wasn't very fun. Why not? It's always fun back in the past. Do you know what the word of the day is? Uh, chick. Chick. No, it's a nostalgia. Nest egg jelly. Not nest egg jelly. It's nostalgia. Do you know what that means, silly? Um, no. It, does it mean n n eggs? Nothing about eggs unless you have a fondness for your past eggs. Oh, uh, I never laid an egg. I am a male, I think. I'm not my husband. Uh, yeah. Uh, how do you know? Ha ha. Anyway, what were we talking about? Nostalgia. The fondness for the past. The good old days. Remember on Sesame Street? Now we're in this purple room and we're not on Sesame Street. Remember the good old times? Oh, yeah. That sounds kind of familiar. Like nostalgia. Does that mean old? Yeah, you know how we're old? Old puppets? Uh, speak for yourself, mister. I'm a new bird. Look at me. Mm -mm -mm. Well, I'm old as the shit. I'm just kind of thinking about the past right now, and I just really miss my grandma. She was such a cool lady. She used to like serial killers like Jeffrey Dahmer and John Wayne Gacy and Ted Gacy? Bundy. That's, that's, that's scary stuff, man. I don't know. It's not like she killed anybody or anything, or to, you know, maybe. That you know of. That I know of. That's but right. She was so cool. I miss her. Well, you know, when you think about the past, sometimes it makes you a little sad and melancholy, but sometimes you you can you can find things that make you think of the past that make you happy. Remember last week when you found that golden ticket? Uh, yeah, sure, that golden ticket. Yeah, it was for a free hug. Aw, thanks so much. That just makes me feel so good. You're redeemed. I'm, I'm redeemed for what? Your, your, your ticket's redeemed. You, gotta, you can't use it again. What? No more hugs for you. Well, why is it even a golden ticket? It's just a regular old hug ticket. Should have just been great like regular old hug tickets normally are. I just don't. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I, oh, oh, that makes me feel. I like her. A little bit over encumbered. What's your favorite letter? Hi. <laughs> you got on the spot. What's your favorite letter? Which one makes you the happiest? Which letter makes me the happiest? Probably the letter R. <laughs> you look pretty fucking silly right now. Oh, I'm sorry. Your eyeballs are fucking up. <laughs>
Space Jam Nightlight. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday. 